Chapter 1085 of One Piece has sparked significant speculation among fans regarding the identity of Nefertari Lily, leading many to believe she could be Kazuki Toki. It is not uncommon for Oda to subtly introduce characters in his narratives, deliberately concealing their true nature until later in the story's progression. At present, Oda has chosen to keep the appearance of Nefertari Lily, a new character introduced in Chapter 1084, a secret. As explained by Cobra, Queen Lily vanished eight centuries ago with no historical records mentioning Nefertari Lily. These circumstances have fueled fan conjecture that Lily may in fact be Kazuki Toki. Chapter 1084 depicted Nefertari Cobra meeting with the Gorosei as he sought to uncover the truth behind Nefertari Lily. As Cobra revealed, Lily was the Queen of Alabasta, who mysteriously vanished without a trace eight centuries ago. Intriguingly, there exists no historical record documenting Lily's existence. This revelation piqued Cobra's curiosity regarding the whereabouts of Queen Lily. However, when he posed the question to the Goro, say they evaded providing a direct answer, claiming ignorance regarding Lily's fate. Yet, many suspect that both the Goro say and Emu were concealing the truth. There is a prevalent theory that speculates a connection between Lily's disappearance and preceding events. According to this hypothesis, Nefertari Lily could potentially be Kazuki Toki. According to this fan theory, there are several clues in the One Piece story that suggest Nefertari Lily and Kazuki Toki are the same person. Oda is known for carefully introducing the past stories of main characters and important characters in the series. Oda pays great attention to details regarding characters' pain, trauma, and motivations. However, if we observe closely, these aspects are not revealed in Toki's character. The story begins when she emerges 20 years ago and attempts to reach Wano. We are never told the reason or purpose behind Toki's journey to Wano. Furthermore, the information presented in Chapter 1084 confirms that Lily's origin dates back 800 years. After playing a role in the formation of the world government, Lily mysteriously vanished. Another clue lies in the possibility that Toki is not her real name but rather a pseudonym used to conceal her true identity, which is Nefertari Lily, as depicted in the Wano arc. By assuming this false identity, the theory suggests that Lily intentionally sought out the Kazuki clan in Wano. The Kazuki clan is known to have a close connection with the D clan, while Wano itself operates independently of the world government's control. Hence, it is plausible that Nefertari Lily sought assistance from the Kazuki clan to aid in her grand plans. If this theory holds true, it could shed light on the contents of the letter Odin entrusted to Toki before his death. In the letter, Odin indicates that Toki has a role or task associated with her devil fruit powers. In chapter 1085, Toki writes a letter to her descendants, urging them to safeguard the Ponic Lift and bring about significant changes in the world. Perhaps Toki's true purpose was to facilitate profound transformations in the world. How did she plan to achieve this? By establishing contact or forming alliances with groups or factions capable of instigating such changes, such as the Kazuki clan. Meanwhile, Lily's disappearance could be attributed to her journey into the future to execute her master plan.